Okay, so now we're back at our table and we're gonna cut up and prepare our master to make our mold. So we've got our CD here, just a regular CD, um, and we're gonna cut about an eighth of the CD, just like this. It's a little hard to cut, <laughs> but it works. This is why we wear eye protection. Now I'm just gonna take this carbide pen and I'm gonna, right now I'm on the shiny side up, which means that this is the polycarb. So I'm gonna scratch an F backwards. so that when we flip it over, we'll be able to tell which is the side that has the um, mold on it. I'm not sure if they'll be able to see that, but. You can maybe see, there's a little F in the corner now that's backwards. Sure. So now we're gonna remove the aluminum. with some tape. So I'm putting tape side down. Obviously, that's how tape works. And now I'm gonna peel off, hopefully. So now we've got our master here. The data is all encoded on the aluminum. And then this was a mold, the polycarbonate mold. Um, and because I put my F on the corner, I now know when it says a regular F, that means front. And this is mold side up. And then it's just the regular plastic on the bottom. So we'll put our mold over there and now we're gonna make a new mold with our own material using the aluminum master so I've already prepped this pe petri dish with some double-sided tape and we're gonna stick this down on it We don't want our mixture to get underneath when we're making our mold. So I'm gonna tape it down a little more on the sides that are sticking up. We'll do one more little. Now we have <laughs> our aluminum taped down in our petri dish. So shiny. Ready for our next steps. Okay, moving right along. Um, we are now going on to the last step here where we're going to take our PDMS that we just took out of the vac oven and we're gonna pour it into our uh, master here and we're gonna do our best to try and minimize bubbles so I'm gonna pour it all in one go here it comes Pouring it all over our master. And it's 
gonna be awesome. So there's a couple of small bubbles in there, so I'm going to try and pop them with a pipette. So remember we were talking when we had it in the vacuum about trying to eliminate bubbles. And we asked you to think about why you don't want bubbles in here. Did you think about it? We're going to go put it into the oven again, or into the oven, so that we can cure it and come out with our fun product.